You guys have just done a tour with Catch a Fire. Do you have any standout shows from that tour? Oh, oh! I think always Zopanoni is always a. It's a pretty special place to play in. The location, the seafood, everyone leaves with the gal. <laughs> so, yeah. You guys were originally defined as alien funk rock. Was it? <laughs> yeah, would you say that's still what you'd call yourselves today? Yeah, I think it's. Um, just gives us the uh, the ability to, to to create whatever we want, whatever we think is. It's just stuff that we like, you know. Yeah. How do you guys go about writing your stuff these days? Oh, it's I suppose a little bit more difficult. Eh? Everyone lives in different parts of the country. Nowadays, we generally just come up with an idea on the computer at home. Everyone's got their little setups at home, and then we'll just share the idea with each other, and then. Um, once everyone puts their ideas in it, it becomes something completely different altogether. Right, so you guys have been around for a while now, so since you've started, have you seen a big change in the music industry? Yeah, huge changes in a real short amount of time too. I think uh, the biggest change that I've noticed is the digital realm and the release of music and how accessible the music is nowadays. Um, I think it's fair to say not many albums are sold because once Spotify gets it, um, it's over. Uh, in terms of sound, yeah, it's gone real, everyone's using a lot of synthesizers. A lot of synths there, yeah. a lot of production, like real, really, really produced sort of music's coming out, eh? Uh, I don't mind just the straight, no sequence, yeah, 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 band, yeah. straight band stuff, eh? That, We're that still a bit old die. school to heart. <laughs> <laughs> awesome, thanks for your time, guys. Oh, pleasure, cool, thanks, thanks, guys. Thank